Good afternoon, Ridgeview High School, and thanks for watching the Ravens Report. I'm Austin Purcell. And I'm Kiwi. It's Monday, March 31st. Welcome back from spring break. We'll be on a regular bell schedule tomorrow. Attention seniors, the time has come to pick up your announcements, rings, and other orders. Jocelyn's will be here on Thursday during lunch in the Skybox to hand them out. Be sure to pick up your orders on Thursday at lunch. Orders need to be paid in full for you to receive your senior swag. It's been a busy spring already for Mr. DeRoss. He is anticipating an addition to his family soon, and his child is coming from a long way. Emily Trumpus of the Ravens Report has more. Um. <laughs> All around the world, there are children waiting for a loving family and a place to call home. Mr. D. Ross is changing the life for one of these very special children. Seth is 20 months old. Um, he, we don't know a lot of details, but we found out that he, um, we know that he was abandoned by, on, the, on the edge of a river. And um, he was found by the police and taken to a state-run orphanage. And he was really, really sick, and he, the doctors right away um, found out that he had a severe heart defect. It's called HLHS, hyperplastic left heart syndrome. And basically what that means is he has half of a normal functioning heart. Um, he also has a lot of other complicated things going on, um, blocked arteries and um, things that uh, just make it a really difficult uh, thing to treat. And so his best chance would be to get him here to have surgery. Um, in the United States. Many families all over the world decide to adopt and the D. Ross family knew it was the right time for them. Our decision to adopt really uh, springs from our faith and um, it's just a chance to um, show love to uh, a little kid who needs it, who um, he's been waiting on a list to be adopted for over a year and nobody's wanted him and um, this is really just a way for uh, me and my family to tell Seth that you matter and that we love you and that we want to give you a family and give you something to go through this with, somebody to go through this with and um, I think it's uh, really adoption is, um, we, we believe it's just a, a really beautiful picture of the way that um, God loves us and he rescues us when we, we need it most and um, it's just something that is our way to uh, reflect that love to the rest of the world. Adoption is a huge process that doesn't happen overnight, but in the end, it is all worth it. I'm Emily Trumpus, signing off for the Ravens Report. Thanks, Emily, and congratulations to the DeRoss family. We're all excited to have a new Raven from far away. National Honor Society applications are now available in the front office. They are due back by April 11th, which isn't that far away. It's the end of next week. More student-produced news stories, sports highlights, and other fun stuff can be found on the school's YouTube page at youtube.com forward slash Ridgeview Ravens. I'm Kiwi. And I'm Austin Purcell. Thanks for watching the Ravens Report. Have an epic day and stay classy, Ridgeview. Save me from this.